Hello guys and welcome to the Music Empire. And in today's lesson, we are coming to do something very interesting. We are not coming to learn the song, but rather, we are coming to pick a song that we have learned on this channel and then put a very wonderful um, local piano lick in the song. And this is based on creativity by purely using two skills and combining them together to form that lick or phrase, however you call it. Okay, so we will be in the key of F for this lesson. And then I feel like when it comes to F, I don't even have to show you the scale of F. Everybody knows the, the scale of F, but let's just quickly go through the scale of F. Okay, so F becomes the one or the do, G becomes the re or the two, A becomes the me or the three. B flat becomes the fa or the four, and then C becomes the so or the five, then D becomes the la or the six, and then uh, E becomes the T or the seven, then to your one, okay? Like I said earlier, the lick is based on two scales. So let's take a look at these two scales. Um, the first scale is a dominant scale, and then the second scale is the melodic minor scale okay so let's take a look at the dominant scale and the dominant scale is just like the major scale okay but this time instead of playing the seven for the t you play the tall and this is a very powerful skill we use in Ghanaian uh, high life or praise or even worship a lot a lot you see it's like every popular Ghanaian song that you pick will probably have a, a feel of the dominant skill in it okay so the dominant skill is very simple to play okay so it's just a major skill but with a tall instead of a t and the second skill that we want to take a look at is the melodic minor skill which is also often used in Ghanaian music and the melodic minor skill is also just like the major skill but instead of the three or the me, you play the minor third or the flat three or the more. Okay, so instead of playing the major scale like this, this time you play it with the minor third included whilst you omit the, the major third. So. Okay, so you have learned two skills. The first skill is what the dominant skill, which is the. So don't forget this tall note and then the melodic minor note the me and the melodic minor scale which utilizes the minor third. So we are focusing on two main notes here, the minor third and then the minor seventh or the dominant seventh instead of the me and the T or the third and the tall, right? Good. Now this is the leg out of creativity and I use it in uh, local breeze or high life a lot which is uh yeah it's very simple so you can say that we i'm play, i'm using the f major scale itself but then i have my my dominant seventh right or the minor seventh the what is this the minor third right that, so how do i use this lick in uh ghanaian high life or ghanaian praises um you agree with me that most ghana songs will have uh, this circle of fourth which starts from the me to the la right then to the re so all the three six two five one it's a very popular progression that we find in most ghanaian songs and even foreign songs and all that but we are focusing on ghana high life and praises okay so i use it when there is a need for me to do or to use three six two five one in a song so you see anytime we are playing a Ghanaian high life or, or praises and then we get to the part where we have to use three six two five one that is where we use this that's what that's why i normally use this lick so let me slowly show you how it will be used so, so on the on the three ok 
Okay, so let's add this one. One seven or do tea. So that it will cover the soul aspect, right? So okay. So now let, let's break down the, the, the lick itself, then we add it to our progression. So it starts on the do or the one to the three or the me. Okay. So do me redo, right? Then we we'll go to our dominant seventh. So tall as we locally call it then we come to the la so it's like we have two patterns now the first pattern is this then the second one is okay so try it together try the two together so la to la so fa so the third one will be so from the, from the flat three to the two, or oh, which is more do la ti, okay, or oh. so if you combine everything, it will be then you play your five chord, right? Then to the one. Now remember, I'm not coming to teach you a song. It's a lick that we are putting in a song. So we are coming to use Audacity. Okay. And, and then Kwesi Asani has taught that lesson on this channel with, with very powerful bass lines and powerful chords. So if you haven't watched that lesson before, I'm leaving a link in the description section. So go there, you find a link, click on it, and then it will take you directly to the video. Then you watch the full breakdown on Audacity, a Ghanaian highlight for Ghanaian praise song. Okay. it's a very powerful lesson if you haven't watched yes so if you have watched and you have learned then there's an opportunity for you to put this lick inside as well as any other Ghanaian song that has a three six two five one we have a lot we have a lot okay so now let's let's do some little practice before we put it in a song so like I did earlier slowly to the six now on the six I have a D major chord so la major okay so la d mi so a la d mi okay to the two then to the five i'm not really playing anything special with my left hand okay so to the two then and then practice it slowly till you are able to i mean uh, be at the tempo where you can put it in a high life for praises okay Yeah, but practice it slowly. And then let me show you my finger positions. Finger position sometimes doesn't really matter, but sometimes it's very important. The finger position I use, that makes me very comfortable. Is, you see, I start with my, is it a long finger? To my pinky finger, then ring finger, okay? And I believe you can even steady my finger position from the video itself, even without me talking about it, so. So my index finger will play that all. Oh, yeah. Then I quickly switch. So. So. After the index finger plays the, the, the flat seven, the long finger will switch with the index finger, then the index finger will come and play the la or the six. So, so the long finger will play the B flat itself, not the index finger. So, so see, then the long finger will play the B flat, so that the index finger can play the minor third to the two. Okay, so the index finger will play the minor third to the two. Then the pinky finger will play the one to the seven. Oh. Yes. If I find it very difficult to do this, then I will encourage you to do this. I think this is the most popular finger exercise you can ever do. In the key of C. And then build the speed, okay? 
then you, you, you perform it on it's it's my on the minor chord as well so take it to the rest of the keys so um, to the five so now let's put it in our song or that's any okay and then let's see. So like I said, I'm not learning the other singing. I'm just trying to put it inside. So I won't play anything special. So. Okay, very good. So we did just a very small demonstration there. Okay, so I believe you saw it. So let's go over the song again and then note carefully where I play where I play the lick. Okay, it's always on the three six two five one part. And then from here onwards, your assignment should be to uh, take a look at the other Ghanaian songs and then look for the three six two five one or the Milari Sudo part and then put them inside. <laughs> So you see, so then I found that as a man apart. So So you see that part, that part is where we, we apply it because from then I found that as a you see three, then six. Then to the two. Okay, that's how you apply it. So then I see this part. So from here, the next thing to do is to take it across the rest of the keys. Please do. So you can start from C. You don't even know we learned this lesson in F. You can start from C. So yeah, it's too heavy. So yeah, too feels too light. It's funny. Let's take it across the rest of the keys, George. Okay, so let's take it across the so let's take it across the rest of the keys, and you'll be fine. Remember, three, six, two, five, one, mi, la, re. So when we get to the mi, to the la, re, su, part, that's where. So God bless you for watching this lesson. If you haven't subscribed, please do and click on the notification icon because more of these local leaks. We'll be doing local leaks in worship, local leaks in praises. Sometimes we may even do some in reggae and all that. Yes, to enhance our creativity when it comes to the local play. 
because the progressions themselves are not difficult but what makes you stand out is your creativity so we'll be doing a lot of creativity in our local piano lessons okay so make sure you subscribe and then comment and then like as well if you like this lesson don't just watch and go away please like okay and god bless you so much let's meet in our next lesson